Here we go. We are about to begin preliminary round one. Take a deep breath. Don't let it out. This is question one of the 2015 National You Be The Chemist Challenge. So competitions like this are popular among students. They, they like the competition. They like to see how they stand against one another. I think in all, it's a good uh, growth experience. I passed the uh, school test, and after that, local, and then the state and uh, national is uh, today. So I tried it out, and then it turned out to be wonderful, and I started loving chemistry. I re studied really hard for the state because I really wanted to come to the nationals. And then state, I surprised myself by winning. It has been a, an incredible challenge so far. and We've had four tough preliminary rounds, and we are down to our top 10 scorers. Extremely rewarding for all of us to support a program like that where you see the kids being passionate about science as much as we are. Seeing the, the wide range of ages from fifth graders to eighth graders, I just think it's great that so many kids are involved. We now have our 2015 National Challenge Top Four. Here we go, quarterfinal round, first question. I'm excited that so many different companies are actually getting involved in this. This is certainly a passion of mine, having been a teacher for 25 years in science. Companies really show that they know what's important for the students. Science is very important to the students and the teachers and the adults as well. I think it's awesome that all of these companies are, are putting money into this competition because it's really important to encourage young scientists to get into science. So this opens their eyes to different people in the field. They get to meet scientists and engineers, which is really cool. Um, and they get to predict what a future might look like for them. I think chemistry at work as a theme has really been great to help students understand the range of possibilities, whether they want to go into neuroscience or physical chemistry, whether they want to be in academia or industry. Science explains uh, not just everyday life, but also not everyday life, right? Like um, vast space or, or the smallest particles. Really to see the growth of this and to come here tonight and see just the energy and excitement that everyone has and just the incredible talent of these kids at such a young age. And your 2015 National Challenge Champion, Daniel Liu. We know that there is an issue in STEM education. What we're trying to do through this program is really to promote chemistry and to really build the workforce of tomorrow. You're the next generation of innovators and your story is just beginning. We're all looking forward to everything that you're going to discover that will make this world a better place. I just wish that more of my students could have come with me, but I will be bringing this back to my classroom to share with them the excitement. My favorite thing about studying science is that we get to learn about our natural world around us and we get to put that in ways that other people can understand so that we can spread our knowledge and apply it to our everyday lives.